Today's topic is poo, and it's time for one of my favourite games. What, the boring game for sensible people? No! Today we're going to play Who's Poo's? Well, this sounds amazing. Jacket, please. What, this? Welcome to Who's Poo's, everyone. On this tray, I have an arrangement of poos of different species of animal. Well, you can't bring poo into the kitchen. What? It's not a kitchen, it's a lab. And anyway, these are fake poos. Oh, OK. Nazar, you have 15 seconds to match the poo to the different species of animal. You have five choices of animal, and poos are on the tray. Can you match up the poos too? Which one belongs to a hyena, elephant, mayfly, lion, or a blue whale? Zand, here is your tray of poos. And your time starts now! Ooh. OK, uh, lion. Well, a lion's like a big cat, so maybe that one looks a bit like a big cat poo. Elephants are big, so it might be the biggest poo. You better hurry, Zand. Um, hyenas, someone told me that hyena poo was white, so I think it's that one. Three, uh, two, one. I'm running one. out of poo. I think that's right. Time's poo. up! Chris, you've forgotten the poos. There's only four here, and I'm missing the mayfly. Honestly, you've messed up the game, Chris. Well, I'm afraid, Tom, so, because you didn't complete the task in the time allotted, I have here a bucket of mayfly poo, which I'm going to throw over your head. <laughs> uh, wait a minute. Nothing happened. That bucket's empty. That's right, because did you know, because mayflies only live for 24 hours, they don't poo at all. Well, no, I didn't know that. No, I didn't think you would. And did you know that elephant poo and horse poo are quite similar because they both digest their food in the same way? They are known as hindgut fermenters. I didn't know that either. Did you know that blue whale's poo is sometimes pink because of all the tiny little shrimp-like krill that they eat and they can poo up to 200 litres at a time? I did not know that. Did you know that hyena poo is white because they can eat bones? They have one of the strongest bites of any animals. I didn't know that either. And finally, did you know that lion's poo is very smelly because lions eat meat? And that is the same reason that dog poo and human poo is also really smelly. Well, well did you know that you're a poo head who smells of poo? I know you are, but what am I? I didn't think he'd have such a good comeback to that. Well, let's have a big round of applause for Dr Zahn. Thanks for being such a wonderful contestant. I'm sorry that today you were a who's poo's loser. But it's goodbye, ta-ta, and poo-poo from me, and we'll see you next time for more Who's Poo's. Poo-poo. It seems like you can tell a lot about an animal by looking at its poo, and you can tell a lot about a human too. You can figure out if I've been eating sweet corn by looking in the toilet before I flush. And I have some fake human poo right here. Now, I've made this to look like constipated poo. It's little hard pellets, a bit like large rabbit droppings. Now, the thing about constipation is that you get it if you don't eat enough fibre because your poo dries out and it can be very uncomfortable. It can mean that you don't poo for several days in a row and it can make your bottom and your tummy hurt a lot. I love fibre. Me poo.